I started my career in HR right out of undergraduate school and um, I learned my first lesson uh, when I started because I was certain uh, about what I wanted to do and also what I didn't want to do. So I started in a leadership development program and my first assignment was, when, was in compensation. Uh, and I had no interest in compensation at the time. So I did some different things. I did a global study of non-traditional benefits. I was the compensation lead for the corporate staff functions. I did some work around um, paid time off and productivity. And after several years in the rewards organization as part of this program, I found that I really liked it and I thought I wanted to spend my career there. But Learning my lesson from the first time, I decided not to be so certain, and I had an opportunity to take a role as an HR business partner. And so uh, that was a great experience for me. I really learned um, how important it was to be close to the business and close to the talent in the organization, and I learned the implications of the uh, policies and practices that the work um, that I had been doing uh, from a COE role. And so. That gave me great perspective as I um, went back to the COE role after that. I decided to leave the organization where I was and I went to another global company um, where I was leading compensation for the organization and uh, specializing in policies and practices and programs. Really a fantastic learning experience for me. And then a really unique opportunity came up and it would have looked like a step backwards if you were looking at it on paper. So I was leading a team and the opportunity that, that was presented to me was to be an individual contributor in a specialty area within rewards that I hadn't worked in before. So I took the risk and uh, I changed companies and happily 10 years later I'm still here at Cigna. Uh, and my time here, uh, my role has changed multiple times over the years and, and expanded from executive compensation to broad-based compensation and ultimately I was leading the um, global compensation function within HR. Then about a year ago, another uh, fantastic opportunity here at Cigna and I took the role of uh, Vice President of Rewards and HR Operations, which is the role I'm in today and I'm responsible for compensation, benefits, HR analytics and HR operations. For me, achieving success was really about taking on roles even when I was not 100% confident in my ability to do them. So I've taken roles uh, where I was anxious about it, where I was uncertain because I didn't necessarily have 100% of the technical abilities for the role, but I felt I had the aptitude to learn in the role. I felt like I had great support around me and that has been something consistently in my career.